Hey, Hachimura. Luke Kennard misses. You want to see a shooter. This guy, Davis Bertans, is in the game right now. Stretches out that 6'10", gets to the basket. Look at those long, long arms. And you could tell he enjoyed being with the kids. Out of the timeout, Bertans dials it up and knocks it down. This guy is lethal, really. 31. Derek Rose on the piston end misfires. Rebound, hustled down okay, by Bertans. Right, right. Come to Detroit, and it's not Golden State of Cleveland. <laughs> Davis Bertans. Look at that shot. The former piston works against Langston Galloway. This to, to Berton, shot is blocked by Thon Maker. Nice shot by Thon, but there's a swipe by Ish. Berton stops, the leaning glasser goes. How good is that? Well, ESPN Zach Lowe, a brighter analyst, the good would calls him the Latvian laser. Well, I'll tell you what, there are a lot of guys that would not have been comfortable enough to pull up. They would have tried to go all the way to the basket, probably would have charged. He was very comfortable, George, pulling up, going off the window from seven feet. This guy. On the 6'10", Bertans will drive it, dish it in the corner, speed misses. Bertans with a rebound. Bradley Beal. They go to Bertans, wide with it from distance, and the crowd lets him know about it. I think the fact that he was aggravated, I mean, hot yeah. about a couple of no calls might have affected that shot. Remember as he did in the second half in Houston in the victory over the Rockets. First possession, second half. Berton. Sideline to Thomas, and he triples. Bonga on the run. Bertans with a quick release. This is off the heel. Thomas with the clock at 10. And inside. Bradley Beal against Tony Snell. Topside Bertans. Down deep it goes to Mahinmi. Nice play. You watch the Washington Wizards. If, if they were to somehow develop a defensive constitution, as a group, this could be a pretty good basketball team because on the offensive end, Thomas to four court. Bradley Beal along the baseline. Bertans against Luke from the P177. Bertans, top side three, around and off. Luke Kennard pitches it down deep. Marquis Morris blocked by Bertans. Joy Brown, top side to Beal. Inside to Berton, gives it up. Schofield missed the shot. Bertons and Markeith Morris get tangled up. You have to kind of uh, watch this right at the free throw line. Markeith Morris, Davis Bertons. Markeith deposits him. Bertons gets up, and Georgia. I can promise you he was probably saying, come on, somebody. They could foul one is the call. First free throw. The first point of the second half. While the margin is slim, it continues to be maintained by these Wizards. It's four now. Bertans to the basket. Block shot by Thon Maker ruled a goal 10. And you wonder, would it have had a chance to go in? Uh, it's not going to be an easy shot. Shooting back across his body. And I don't know if that would have gone in. He was determined to get a shot up. 109-107 Washington. Bertans against Luke. Cross courts to Thomas, and he triples. 21 to 113, Washington. 
Steele gets a Mahimi screen. Berton from distance drains it, falling down. He has a chance for a four bagger. The whistle blows. This is a big guy who moves like a much smaller guy without the basketball. And you can see Luke Kennard really didn't give him a whole lot of room to come down and shots gone, so you're not affecting that. And here where he here's where he gets his three-point opportunity with a four-point opportunity, which he cashes in. That was devastating right there. Bertans didn't score in the third. Has seven here in the fourth. Derrick Rose for three. Short. Rebound. And the Washington Wizards have surprised the Pistons here. 133 to 119.